What is going on guys, the Ultimate Gamer Nation here, and welcome back to part 118 of Let's Play Sims 2 The Anderson Season 3, University Students Household. So I really wanted to do Andersons today. I didn't, I, I don't know, I originally wanted to do another Orphans Challenge episode, but I just wanted to do Andersons today and then get the cycle over with, so that way I can start off with uh, whatever family is next in the cycle. Well, actually, yeah, this is the last family in the cycle, so I can start new with the new cycle and then start whatever I, whatever is most requested. Uh, because we have been we haven't been doing those other families in a while, and I just want to get this over with, and hopefully Brooke and Kylie can graduate. But I doubt it because it's going to take a while, like especially 72 Sims hours. You think I can do that in one episode? Probably not. And I'm just talking really fast because I don't know. I, I just felt like it. <laughs> I'm sorry if you didn't hear anything what I said. Uh, so Lori, go ahead and uh, clean that up because our cafe cafeteria worker is not going to do that. Uh, no. And she's like, oh, man, I have to clean this. That sucks. Yeah, it probably it really does. Um, in the last episode, we had Ryan recently graduate with honors and moved out of this household after living here for several parts. More than 50, I guess. Like, really? Yeah, I think more than 50 parts. Um, but that really didn't involve him as much because we were in a cycle and not all those parts apply to him because, yeah, those weren't his family's, so, yeah, whatever, parts. So, yeah, I'm going to have Lori clean this up again. She didn't clean it all. She's not a very neat sim, I could say, because she didn't do all of that. Yeah, as you can see, she does not know what to do. She does not know how to clean. This is why she is so sad, trying to clean this up. And she is a little... Oh, yeah, in the last episode of uh, Gabriella's Family, I think, she came over and she was, like, pretty fat. So I'm going to have her exercise because she needs to get fit. It's not healthy. It's not healthy to be this way. So, I'm gonna go use the restroom real quick. And Brooke and Kylie, since you started a new semester as a senior, this is our last one. Hopefully, you pass it. Yeah. Okay. Uh, go ahead and write your term papers because this is the number one thing I number one priority right when they uh, start a new semester. So, it gets them a good boost. A good boost. And Lori as well. She did not do hers yet. Oh, she just started her year two semester. Whatever. And then the maid is like, I cannot reach that. I don't know why. Oh. Uh, you can get through that, can you? Well, this, this girl is going to get trapped in here because she, this guy's in the way. Okay, I'm just going to give them like... Maybe we can turn the uh, the couch this way. It would probably look better this way anyways, right guys? I think so. Okay. Let's hope, hope, yeah, now they can move. Awesome. Apparently it takes bigger space than what it appears. Okay. Alright, I was going to have you go ahead and get fit. Or get fitter. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. Get more fit. You have to use the... I don't quite remember the exact term for it. It's like superative or... Com Superlative or comparative? I don't know. It was one of those two forms. It's an English term, so... Yeah, some of you will probably learn that later on. But my favorite English teacher was probably in 8th grade. Yeah, I learned that from her. I still remember it to this day somehow. Because I always forget everything, especially my favorite subject. Like, ugh. Anyways, let's have her go ahead and work out. And have enough of me rambling on about my life. I was down myself. Yeah, I know that's not good. But it's just, it's just a joke. I don't mean it seriously, though. So don't worry. Don't worry. Alright, so... What's her face? Kylie and Cole haven't been interacting with one another for a while now, and they are engaged. So you'd expect them to be loving each other all the time, right? You know, having that the visits and stuff. And when was the last time she had a date with him? That's the thing to consider, is that her relationship with Cole at the moment is not healthy. Because they're always separated with e from each other. So, I can tell their date was from a long time ago. This is a couple memory memories ago, yeah. So I'm going to have her invite Cole over again once she is finished with her term paper. I know we do this all the time, but we have to make the best out of it somehow. I might put Cole into our household so that way they can interact with each other more instead of calling him here all the time. But I don't really want to take care of another sim though, especially with my condition at the moment. I'm gonna go crazy. Just kidding. Again. 
Okay, anyways. Anyways, anyways. Okay, I know you want food. You're that type of sim that wants food. But no, you're working out whether you like it or not. Are you an active sim? Yeah, you're an active sim, so why aren't you even skinny? She's like, not even nice either. Like, she had a whole personality. I don't know why her personality is like this. Was she always like this before? I just noticed this. Wow, she has a really nasty personality. She is not nice. She's not neat. But she's everything else. And she does not have the desire to get fit. Why is she not wanting to get fit? Do we have to take care of her other needs or something? Is she really want to eat? Okay, I'll do that. I'll give her food. Her weakness. Let's get some nectar and toilet. Okay, this is nasty now. I think we should clean this up. Oh, gosh, 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 gosh. Alright, so Kylie and Brooke. Ooh. Brooke is going to be the heartbreaker sim. She's been hurt many times before, so she will do the same with other people. So let's go have her... Oh, she has chemistry with this guy, Paul McCarthy. Why not, you know, bust a move with him? <laughs> uh, and joke with him. Get her started with him. Oh, wait. You have to go to class. Oh, crap. Is he new? Because I have not seen him around here before. Paul McCarthy. Well, she'll, she'll, heartbreak, she'll break his heart next. Lori's like, I want that food. But I made her clean it up because it's spoiled. And why not serve some more? Because we have money and we're fancy like that. It's gonna say it's gonna serve the same food all the time. Let's have some filet mignon because fancy. Everything, anything that seem that sounds fancy, we will eat it. That's how it is. Okay, let's have you burn some calories. Why don't you run upstairs? <laughs> It's like I'm running, 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 I'm running. Okay. Oh me and Lori have class now. Oh great. Well at least you burned some calories. At least you burned those calories. Alright, speed this up and wait for the others to get back. So surprisingly I came with some plans. Smart investing gave us five hundred and thirty-one more simoleons. I'm sorry my voice my nose, my voice sounds kinda congested. That's because it is, and I'd rather have it clogged up than have it runny and annoy me the whole episode. Because you can breathe with your mouth, so it might it might not sound attractive, but I don't know. I prefer to have a cloggy nose, I guess, over a runny one. Especially on a test at school. If I used to have like a really bad... Okay, I'm going to tell you guys another story while they're going to do what... While Kylie's doing this. Okay, so during my, uh, my state test... Probably back in yeah eighth grade, I had I was very sick and I always get sick during my state test for some apparent reason, and let's hope I'm not sick during my graduation test this week. Hold on. Anyways, so I have a really bad cough and I'm not trying to cough during the test because that would be annoying and I don't like coughing when it's quiet, everyone's quiet. So I like to hold it in, and then it came to a point where. Like, I couldn't hold it anymore, and it was like, bleh, bleh, bleh. it was like I was choking, so. <laughs> that was much more worse than actually just, I guess, letting it out during the test. But it was really bad, though. It sounded like an alien was, like, eating my soul or something. I don't know how to describe it, but it was really bad. So there's my life story. <laughs> oh, wait, we're, we're supposed to invite Cole over. Who's that? Ashley Pitts. <laughs> Your name is Ashley. You would normally think that would be a girl name, but I guess it could be applied to a man too, or boy. Like Taylor can be a boy's name. It can be a girl's name. Like Taylor. Okay, now you're gonna comp now you're gonna say that. Now you're gonna say that. So yeah, there's a lot of I guess both gender names. Like Ryan can be a girl's name. I, d I just found that out. Like in my class, there's a girl named Ryan. So. Yeah. We don't really uh, over. We don't really confront. We're not really encounter these types of names with people, but it is around the world. So just gotta accept it. I'm not making fun of the name or anything. Did she get fit yet? Oh, she's still kind of down there. You need to exercise and eat right. Oh, eat. I didn't know eating right can affect your your weight. Like in the game, of course it would be real life, but in the, in the game, wow. No wonder they made vegetarian meals, custom content. Is your boyfriend here yet? 
Oh, uh, there he is. Go greet him with... Actually, go just greet him and she'll make out with him. Because that is what the, the sims do. Even if your sim is not in love with that one sim, you will make out with them if you're very good friends. If they have chemistry or something like that, it will randomly do that. It's like, oh, nice to see you. He's like, oh, cool. Hey, don't you just walk away from her. You gotta talk to her. Ask her how it's going and she'll suck your face off. She's like, look at this. Oh, yeah. Why don't you stay the night in the dorm? Actually, no, I don't want to. Should I? Uh, maybe. Why not? He might not have a place to sleep, but you have a roof over your head. That seems really good to, you know, it's a nice offer. She knows so many people, it takes forever to load. Maybe it's lagging. Yeah, it's lagging. Because they keep, okay, where's Cole at? Cole? You know what, let's just do, like, really chemistry. Let's do chemistry. No. Ew, she has chemistry with me. <laughs> she has chemistry with me. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's my that's my sim again, if you didn't know. By the way, here's the... Some of you did not get the memo yet, either. Uh, did, did we did we say you can stay the night? I think so. Anyways. Uh, I'm gonna have her talk to... Oh, there he is. <gasps> Speaking of... Paul, he wants to talk to us about his hobby. So, let him approach us. This is the first time he's going to be approaching us. He's interested. We have chemistry, too. So, what was I going to say? If some of you didn't get the memo that uh, there's going to be... My, there's a special act after this uh, Season 3 is over. And a lot of you have been asking me, will there be a Season 4? Well, I guess you can consider that special act as a Season 4 because it is involving another Andersons. Well, I guess it's a, another series about the Andersons, but... It's gonna be really short. And, um, it has a lot of memories. That's the hint. What else? And I gave you guys another teaser on my Facebook page. If you follow me on there, you get updates. What's that noise? There's like a really loud banging noise outside my house. I'm scared. Someone's gonna break in my house and, like, kill me or something. <laughs> okay. Sounds like yard work, though. Dang, she has a lot of chemistry with people. Ooh. Oh, she is a romance sim, so expect her to have a lot of chemistry. Oh, we have a lot of victims. Oh, can't wait to get her started on actually being a, a, a skank, a whore. Yeah. So, what do you want, huh? My want is to entertain. Okay, we'll entertain you, all right. We'll entertain you some good. Wait, we can't do that. Oh, wait, we can't. Entertain him with another busted move, I guess. And my nose is running again. Excuse me. Yeah, I'm not gonna blow my nose in a video. I'm just gonna wipe whatever I have coming out of my nose, which sounds really unattractive once again. I'm sorry. But I, we all get sick. That's just how it is. It's life. Dom, dom, dom. Gerbit, gerbit. Go, gerbit. Look at his face. It looks really rotten. He's like, Ugh, why did I sing that song with her? He's probably like, I want that ash. <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm just, Oh, this cheerleader. She wants to say goodbye. Uh, you stink. Don't even dare try to speak with us. Let's cancel her action. Um, why do I, why do I keep doing the same things? I don't know. This is just my typical whatever. Try and tickle him. He's probably gonna reject it or something. Oh, maybe not. He likes that. She's irresistible. Do you have any of those lifetime things? No, you don't. But you have a lot of a lot, a lot of points. You do have a lot of points. Friendly hug. He loves her. Oh, we did, we're doing something right. And I did that again. Oops. I'm running out of ideas. Let's give him a back rub. Classic dance. All right. So now Kylie, where's Cole at? Where's your boyfriend at? Is he sleeping in your room? Actually, no. Your room is locked. He probably can't get in there. Where he be? Cole, where are you? Are you in someone's room? I hope not. Who's this person? Oh, it's Cole. Oh, there he is. Oh, he f he fell in love with her. Aw. What does he want to do now? 
Oh, we're classic dancing. Oops. Look like he wanted. Wow, Cole is actually, he's a loner. He's a loner. You guys see this? He's playing by with himself. This girl, Pamela. I, Kylie's got her eyes on you, and she knows that you you be looking at this guy. Her, which is her fiance technically, because they are engaged. Okay, what take? What is taking you so long to get upstairs? Why aren't you sprinting? If a woman or a girl is trying to steal your man, wouldn't you want to go sprint up there? Or a man, or a woman is trying to okay, or a, oh whatever, just you know what I mean. This is the brain of a sick person. I can't. You want us to play with you? We'll make you feel less lonely. Don't worry. Don't worry. You're terrible at this game, you know that? It's like, would you like to play with me? I actually have a contestant. Aw, oh, isn't this romantic? Isn't this romantic? Okay, whoa. Shouldn't he be doing that to her? Because that looks very feminine on him. She's like, I'm the man in this relationship. I got the pants in this relationship. You got the dress. What are you going to do? Woohoo? I'm just kidding. <laughs> okay. <laughs> wow, that was weird. Okay, uh. Well, in university, if you have a double bed somewhere, you can actually woohoo. So, what we're going to do. Oh, wow. I thought she had. Whoa. For some reason, I thought two Sims were in a room with each other and they're going to do it. But let's go f have a. D -d 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 -d. I'm going to delete this. Because we don't even use it anyways. What's the point? I mean, it's just for decoration, you know? But we're going to buy her a double bed, and they're going to woohoo for the first time in college, because that's what college students do, don't they? And we'll give her, I guess, this bed. It's from the Orphan's Challenge, but it's, I guess, is a different pillow color, you could say. And guess guess what? Cole, can has, he, he can have a place to sleep, you know? Man, I'm stuttering. But you know what I mean again. Right. Okay, I, I kind of mixed that up a bit. This was supposed to be on the left side, and this was supposed to be on the right side. And some Sims 1 music in the buy mode, just for you guys. I, I, I think I've had this set up before. I don't know. Whatever. Okay, let's put a flower. Oh, that's really big. Would you put that type of face on your... Okay, you know what? Let's do that. Why not? Okay, let's go relax and have Cole. We're going to call over Cole. Ask Cole to join. Whatever. He's hungry, but who cares? Call him over. Let's see. Ask to join. What? Ask Cole to join. Oh, yeah. Come here, Cole. I'm waiting for you. Oh, wow. This is really glitchy, but that's okay. Cole. She's waiting. She's waiting. Are you serious? Come on, Cole. Come on, Cole. Get here. Get over here. Oh, his, her door's locked. Oops. <laughs> Unlock the door. Okay. Let's do it one more time. Cole. Cole, where'd you go? Where'd you go, Cole? Where the heck did you go? Oh, upstairs. Um, yeah. And they're still dancing out here. Wow. Okay. Are you guys going to be done now? Can you stop dancing? <laughs> He's like, yeah, Lori's exactly. ugly. Whoa, did you guys see that? He just like flew all over. Just like, I don't know, glitched. But I'm pretty sure he now lives in this dormitory now that Ryan left. He probably took his spot because I have not seen him in my life. Like in this household at all before. Cole! Okay. Cole is coming. And the music. I think she might have a scene because this is her first woohoo, so she's losing her V card. Right, so let's go ahead and. Woohoo! Woohoo! Let's just go straight forward. Let's get into it. Screenshots galore. Here we go. Oh, she's making the move! Woo! Ah, no. <laughs> 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 
That would suck to live in this dorm. <laughs> I just I just realized it would suck to live in the dorm with these types of people like just listening to the sounds like right next door yeah that would be pretty awkward too but yeah she's Lori is finally working out now she's willing to get a little bit more fit although she's failing a little bit but that's okay work for what you want this is exactly what she needs and what she needs to work for you can't just wish for something, you have to work for it somehow. Unless you're a really sneaky person or you, you're a spoiled person, you get whatever you want, like me. But I do work for sometimes for what I want. Like grades, I work for that. Uh, what else? <laughs> I don't know. I'm, I'm a little too loopy right now to think of some things I work for, but I do, I do work for some things. Even though I don't know them at the moment. Okay. So she should be getting normal after this run of working out session whatever there we go eureka the nuances of body skill are suddenly much clearer to me what is this what is this oh maybe it's her because uh the, there's cut there's little uh windows whenever they get fit as well so maybe that could be it Lori, did you finish your turn paper yet i don't recall you actually doing it nope Nope. But I yeah, they did though. Brooke and Kylie have. So it's about 54 hours until the final exams. Um, probably not going to get to have them graduate in this part, unfortunately. But I will work on their uh, college life off camera. And I'll record it for you guys whenever the time comes. So, once again, do not worry. Because we are ending, nearing the ending right now. Probably cannot continue for so long. I actually feel like recording for a while, so I might go on a little bit longer. Who knows? I'm a very unpredictable person, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, dang, she's starving. What if she got pregnant in university? That would suck. Suck for her. <laughs> Is this fresh? I hope that's fresh. I don't want to risk anything. Food poisoning, not my forte. Oh! What do you know? What is this? Is this new? Or did someone put it there? I think someone put it there. Those little punks making me think that the that the cafeteria worker actually knows how to cook something fancy. She just went. Ugh. Yep. Should have known. People do this all the time. They like swap it or something. I don't know. He's smart. He actually ate the cafeteria worker's food instead of the spoiled food over here. I guess. So yeah, Lori is fit again. It's nice to see a slimmer body version of her, but it was kind of cool to see her fat. Not gonna lie, we don't really normally have any fat Andersons. I, I wouldn't say fat, but a little like chubby. They're not that fat. <sighs> okay, so um, yeah, Samantha's portrait kind of like scares me now. Like, oh, whoa, whoa. By the way, I installed a, I don't really say install, but I downloaded, put in a, a, a thingy. It's like this thing, I'll show you guys here. So it's a portrait thing. Why am I like not clicking at it? I don't know. So this is what it looks like. And what you can do with it is, it kind of is self-explanatory. What do you guys see in this picture? You have a vampire right here, a werewolf. You have like a plant sim. You have, I don't know what that is, but. So this portrait allows you to turn into creatures and also also cures you of being something like it, you can't cure being a zombie. So Josh, he wasn't able to be cured as a zombie. So if he ever were to come back alive, I could use that portrait to make him turn into a regular human again. So that is kind of good to have. Um, I don't remember where I got it from. Let me go check for you guys if you want to know where I got this from. It is from, uh, well, I don't know. For sure, I think it's from The Sims Resource or Mod The Sims, one of those two websites. And all you have to do is search up like I don't really know what it was called. I just found it somewhere randomly. So yeah, whatever. <laughs> Does Paul live here? I think he lives here because I see him again. Yep, he took Ryan's room. He's like, oh, you got a mohawk. I'm so fancy. I had a mohawk. 
<clears throat> okay, let's have her go ahead and get ready. Kylie's kind of stinky. And there's more homework over here. Wow. I'm not surprised, though. Not really not. It sounds like it, though. Earn 12,500 simoleons. Ooh. Could do that. Oh, she can lock in two things. I forgot. They can lock in two things. Let's see. What can we lock in? Another. Ask him on a date. Why not? I'm gonna have her and Paul. I'm gonna have her go on a date with Paul. But what time does she go to school? 3 p.m. I guess we can go on a little mini date before we can have her go to class. We can do that. And you go just get ready too, because you are just as bad as Kylie. You gotta say. Look at this. They have a whole like friend breakfast thing going on here. A little group. This guy's doing homework like the lame-o. Just kidding. I'm like one of those people. This is me at school. So we have people eating over here and then I'm here over doing homework like not eating at all. I don't normally eat my my school food. Sometimes I do but sometimes I don't. But yeah that's literally me though. Exactly me. I do homework other than just eat. Others are eating. They're like, Peter, why are you doing your homework? Like, why wouldn't I be doing my homework? I don't want to do it at home. So I'm going to just finish it up here. That's a very good reason. So I guess I'm going to, uh, I think it's about time to end the episode here. If you guys like the video, why not give it a thumbs up? And if you want to continue watching the series, I almost messed that up, but I kind of did. Uh, click the subscribe button if you haven't already. And um, also, hopefully all of you have a fantastic Friday. I just got interrupted by my mother, so that's why you got a weird cut right there. <laughs> um, what else? What else? What else? What else? I always forget what I say at the end of my videos. I don't know why. Maybe it's because of the sickness again. I'm just everything. That's my excuse for everything. But have a fantastic Friday. Uh, have a good day in general. Enjoy your weekend. And until then, stay awesome. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Ugh, I bit my thumb. Ugh. But bye, okay? Bye. <laughs> I can't say it like that. I love y'all. Goodbye, my potatoes. Yeah. <laughs> and there's vermin here. This place is not clean. There might be bugs in our food. There's clearly drugs in our food, guys. Spaghetti looks nice. Not really. Oh, yeah. Yeah.